Hello there. Good afternoon. How how are you? Oh, I'm pretty well. I'm a bit exhausted, but it's fine. Okay, good. My my name is uh, Simon. I'll be your examiner today. So, wh wh what's your name? My Vietnamese name is Phuc An, but my English name is Anna. Uh, okay, good, good. So, uh, where do you live? I currently live in Ho Chi Minh City in Thủ Đức District in a quiet neighborhood. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Uh, yeah, yeah, Maybe? I can hear you. Yeah, oh. th don't worry. Okay. Yeah. And, uh, okay, so wh wh when when you when you go out, wh wh when do you do you usually go out? I usually hang out with my friends and my families at weekends, to the parks or to the the shopping malls. Uh, all right, and what what kind of things do you, do you like to do when you go out with your friends? I have to admit that I love a lot of things. I love doing a lot of things with my friends, such as shooting the breeze or hanging out to the most amusing parks to play to play some dangerous stuff. Uh, all right. And uh, do you spend a lot of money when when you go out? I consider myself a stingy person. So I don't usually spend money on unnecessary things like food or junk food. So I just spend money when it's really necessary. Okay. And uh, so uh, you like hanging out at the moment, but how, how, how will that change in the future, do you think? Because I'm currently a high school student. So I think in the future, I will be preoccupied with much more schoolwork, so I don't really have time for myself. So I think I will have to reduce the time going out with my friends because I have to focus more on my schoolwork as well as relaxing too. Okay, good. So uh, uh, do, do you like inviting friends to, to your house? Mm, actually, uh, to be honest, I love going to my friend's house rather than inviting them to my house because My house is tiny, and it's, I think it's not very comfortable for them to sit in or to celebrate any parties because there isn't enough space. Okay. Uh, uh, when, when you go to someone else's house, do, do, you, do you take a gift or, or, or not, not usually? <laughs> um, usually when I go to someone's party, for example, birthday parties or their anniversary, I will bring some gift like to the owner or just some necessary stuff like drinks or food. But I don't usually drink, bring many, many presents. Uh, okay. Uh, and uh, w w when you're at home uh, alone, uh, do, do you ever, do you use uh, online forms of entertainment? Do, do you use social media at all? I have to admit that I devote most of my time at home surfing the internet via my phone. And although I know that it's not a good habit, I can't really get rid of surfing the net at home all the time. And my dad uh, usually complains about it. All right, and, and how, how much time do you spend on, online, may, maybe in, in a week, do you think? Well, it's very hard to, uh, to count, but I think I spend around three hours a day so that must be 21 hours a week around that uh, okay all right let's have a look at part two then so i'm going to show you a topic yeah. and i'm going to i'm going to give you one, one minute to think about it uh and, and then you can tell me all about it okay, can yeah. you see the topic yeah i can see it clearly okay i'll give you one, one minute yeah
Okay, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, off you go. Yeah. Photos play an important role in my life, and I love taking photos of people and asking people to take photos of me. There was one time around a few months ago when I performed in a competition, in an English, a dancing competition, and I was performing with my team. And after performing, because I was I, I was very happy because my our performance went smoothly. So we went out to take some photos around the, the venue that we performed. I actually my team it's my school team. So there are some there were some teachers accompanying us. I asked one teacher who is a really good photographer to took some photos of me to kind of remind me because I love taking photos because to remind me of the past experiences I have I have passed. So I asked him to took uh, one photo just out of curiosity and for fun. But when he went home and he edited it for me, when he sent it to me, I was taken by surprise because I didn't think that he took really good photos of me and the background was stunning, was amazing. And it's while thinking back about it, I can still feel very touching and very kind of remorseful because I can still remember the, the feeling of the performance as well as the surroundings there. All right, very right, good. So, do, do you still take photos now? I always ask my when I hang out with my friends and my family. I always ask them to spend some time taking photos for me and spend time taking photos together. Moreover, when I went to celebration, when I go to celebrate a celebration, or when I go to any special events. I also make use of the atmosphere to take new photos to post on Facebook too. Okay, and, and so do you think it's important to have a camera on your mobile phone? Oh, it's extremely important and it's undoubtedly, it's inevitable in my life because when I hang out, I feel, uh, I feel something missing when I don't have my phone to take photos because when I see some good sense or some funny, some funny sense, I can't resist the temptations of taking photos. So, uh, okay. Uh, so, uh, do, do you think people have become too obsessed with taking selfies? Well, that's a really big topic, and I think people nowadays, like especially teenagers, they are obsessed with setting selfie to post on Facebook. People call that kind of the life on Facebook and they may be kind of this illusion. And I think that because they really want to, not because they want to keep the memories like me, but they want to show off to, to show the world how, how funny or how well they have passed the time, how well the time they have passed and so, so I think it's really good. Uh, okay, so, so do you think it's still necessary for us to have professional photographers or do you think we could just do everything uh, using our phone? I think having pro a professional photographers to take photos for our, of us is really is necessary, like in social events or in formal events, like when we have the boots or simply or the celebrities, they should have professional photographers to take good pictures for them to post on Facebook. And because, but if we just hang up with our friends doing ordinary things, I don't think it's necessary to have a really stunning, a really amazing photo, a very really stunning camera, which just need to have our mobile phone with us and we can take good photos already. All right, great, great. Well, I, I think we'll, we'll stop the speaking test there because you, you've obviously got a, a good command of English, so I'll, I'll be able to uh, give you a mark from there. So thank you for talking to me today, yeah, and I wish you. you.
every success in the future. So uh, goodbye for now. Yeah, nice. It's nice talking to you. Thank you. No problem. Bye-bye. Goodbye.